Today I will be doing a little bit of an unboxing here. I've been picking up a few things. I want to show you guys what I picked up. I picked up this pocket organizer. Back in the day before the smartphones, those of you that grew up in the 90s, um, you probably know about these. These were the bomb back in the day before smartphones became popular. Um, if you had anything like this, man, you were you were pretty pretty hip, because this here was an organizer, converter, calculator, all those smart tools in a very compact body like this. So when I saw this going for two fifty at the thrift store, I mean I have smartphones that can do all of these, but but just for old time sakes, I picked this up, two dollars and fifty cents. You can't go wrong. So what I'm going to do is change the battery. It looks like the battery is dead. Uh, doesn't turn on. But these things are quite durable. So I'll be replacing the battery and I think it should work actually. And look at what I picked up. My kids are old now. My, I mean I have teenagers now but preparing for, <laughs> for future grandkids maybe. <laughs> Blank video cassette. Sealed. I like these. And charade batman forever batman man of the house i remember this movie when it came out i've not seen it though this one here is hollywood classics and there are five movies on this the front page uh, royal wedding father's little dividend man with the golden arm and penny serenade now I like this because it has some really popular names like uh, Frank Sinatra is in this one, the man with the golden arm. Yeah, it's got names like um, Fred Astaire, who is a, another popular um, actor. Yeah, so you know, I thought it wouldn't hurt to pick it up and check it out sometime. You've got mail. This is an American tale, feeble goes west Elmer Fudd another collection of classics here lead guitar this one here is the greatest bass riffs famous planes of World War two another music tape here this is a blues guitar the mask yay so excited about this I already have one but this is gonna be my backup uh, copy grumpy old man Every every day I feel more like a grumpy old man, so I can relate. Chevy Chase and the National Lampoon's European Vacation. Tweety Bird. And Wayne's World 2. The classic, The Lion King. Little tape here for my mini DV camcorders. I got this for a dollar. Blade, the original. The Hobbit on DVD. Red Dragon on DVD. Blade 2. One of my favorite movies, <laughs> horror movies, that is Final Destination 3. And uh, more, there's more. The Blues Brothers. Jackie Chan's 36 Crazy Fists. I don't think I've seen this one. I really like Jackie Chan's movies. Look at this one. Gulliver's Travels. This is a cartoon. Egghead. Free Willy 3. The Rescue. And Fly Away Home. Wow, take a look at this one, guys. Guess how much I paid for this? Three dollars. Three dollars. Three dollars for this whole stereo player that's amazing now needless to say that this thing only plays cassettes and the radio uh, it doesn't have a CD player in uh, in it but my goodness if, if the cassette player works and if the radio works that's more than worth the three dollars that I paid for it says tested up here it says tested um, 
So here, let's test it out. Let's turn this on. This is on. Okay. Oh, power. This is the power. So turn up the volume. So the volume is a bit scratchy. I'm gonna have to use some deoxy on there. Oh, there so I noticed that the contacts are a bit in here. So what I'm gonna do is just spray some contact cleaner in there and hopefully that will fix it. I don't wanna have to open this thing up to be honest. Just go back and forth with it like that until a little bit more. It's getting better. So the sound is a bit scratchy. I think I'm gonna have to open it up. Uh, I was hoping I could just spray from the outside, but it looks like it's a bit more sealed. Um, so I'm gonna have to open it up, but that's okay. That's fine. I'm gonna do that anyways uh, Clean it up a bit. The sound is really good for For something like this and, it, and the brand is good. It's JVC So I was expecting good sound and I'm not disappointed The sound is rich as you can as you could hear. Oh, you thought I was done. Check this out Dun 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 dun, dun. Look at this amazing figurine. Those of you that are nerds like myself, Star Trek nerds, you know what this is. This is a Ferengi. And I picked this up from the antique mall. And this was going for $23. I could not pass this. I could not pass by this without buying this. I'm a huge Star Trek nerd. And look at that. I just, when I saw it, I was like, man, I'm going to get this. And this is not just a figurine. Check this out. It is actually a piggy bank as well. And if you know anything about the Ferengis, they love their money. And it, this is so appropriate that this is actually a piggy bank. <laughs> I actually put some coins in there and I hope that this brings me wealth. Yay! <laughs> and that's not all. Still on the Star Trek theme, I also picked up this amazing calendar from 1997. The Star Trek calendar. Star Trek Deep Space Nine. That's actually my favorite series of Star Trek Deep Space Nine um, look at that and it's sealed it's still sealed unused that's the back and that's the front so beautiful this one was going for seven ninety five seven dollars ninety five cents and that's Canadian so what I plan to do with this is to, um, I probably will frame each of the photos on this and I'll frame them individually in my studio um, just to create a little bit of a backdrop and because I really, really love Star Trek as well, this is going to be excellent. So that's Quark, one of my favorite characters. Obviously, Benjamin Sisko, wow. Yeah, so this is cool guys. This is so cool. So these are the cool trinkets that I picked up in addition to what I just showed you. And I am so excited about these particular ones.